It's not something that most people predicted about Jadeja at the start of his career. He came in through the Chennai Super Kings, had a horrid first ever T20 World Cup in England. And so he's had to conquer the demons on the outside, the, the, the demons of reputation, if you like. And here's what he said, you know, that he's had to gradually improve his game. And it has paid off for him in the last uh, few years. He's been playing test cricket since 10 years. And uh, as he said, as a youngster, uh, he started in white ball cricket and everyone thought he was a white ball specialist. Now, here he is, DK, 3,000 plus test runs and 300 plus test wickets. I think he started his journey with Rajasthan Royals. I remember the first IPL match ever for Chadija was against Delhi Daredevils. And who was part of the Delhi Daredevils team? Yours truly. And that's my first memory of Ravindra Jadeja. Came in at number six, batted very decently. They struggled to get runs, but he got a 30-40 odd. Hit one of the left-arm spinners for a long six in Delhi, I remember still. And straight away, you knew there is talent. Now, what that has manifested into, because of what work he has put in, is exactly what that statement means. They said he was a white ball superstar. Shane Vaughan, the late, great Shane Vaughan christened him the rock star and till today it still stands the rock star Jadeja he is an absolute rock star in world cricket but his greatest improvement has come in this test format and interestingly as we sit here today I think it's fair to say test cricket has been his strongest suit in the last decade as well has just grown in stature with the bat with the ball and if there is a player who is worth a lot in subcontinent conditions with the bat and the ball currently has to be Jadeja.